If you've ever seen another driver throw a cigarette butt, a wrapper, or any other trash out of a moving car, you're likely not alone. This morning, Caltrans crews were strewn out along the freeway in hopes of raising awareness about an ongoing problem. As KCRE3's Mike Tassell explains, it's a problem that involves your money. You are looking at a persistent problem on California's roadways. It seems as much as we pick up, it's right back the next day. It's a problem that's costing you money. It's absolutely taxpayers' dollars. You are looking at Litter Day 2015, an effort statewide to pick up trash along the freeways and to raise awareness about this issue. Somebody will be, you know, 20 feet away from a, from a receptacle, and they'll just throw that thing out. Look at this. In the past five years, the cost to Caltrans of picking up trash just on the freeways has steadily grown to $63 million a year. Last year alone, crews collected enough freeway trash to fill 12,000 garbage trucks. It's a financial problem. We spend a tremendous amount of money picking up litter every year. And Caltrans says this is the single biggest trash item picked up every year, cigarette butts, followed by fast food trash and then cardboard. Why you should care, Caltrans says, is that picking up this trash diverts tens of millions of taxpayer dollars away from other important road work. Absolutely. Safety improvements, potholes, taking care of the bridges. Uh, absolutely. Bottom line message from Caltrans, if you wouldn't throw trash right on your living room floor in front of the TV, why would you do it out here on California's freeways? Because the freeways are home to an awful lot of commuters. Along Highway 99, Mike Tassell, KCL Ray 3 News. Caltrans also emphasizes that freeway trash often pollutes area waterways, which threatens wildlife. They also say it can pose a driving hazard.